is a film about having your lungs tested in hospital. and this is where we do our breathing tests. Thank you for letting me film today. That's okay, do you want to have a wee seat and then we can have a chat about what we're going to do today. So, Susan, do you take any medications? No. Have you been in hospital for any reason in the last six weeks? No. So, once we know that if things are okay, we can get started with explaining the test. Why would I need a breathing test? Well, breathing tests tell us about how well your lungs are working and sometimes when you're not well, it can affect what your lungs are doing. Right, Susan, we're ready to start now. Do you want to come across to my computer and we can have a wee look at the mouthpiece that we use for the tests? So yeah. this is the mouthpiece that we use to do all our tests, Susan. What we do is we get people to put their lips and teeth around there nice and tight, but we don't like them to put their tongue too close to the opening, just in case um, the ear comes out funny. And then we get them to wear a wee set of nose pegs on their nose so that all the air goes into the machine and none of it escapes out into the room. Would you like to try the nose pegs now? So if you squeeze the top bit, then you can put that bit on your nose. There we go. And we'll just get them pointing up the way so you don't bang your nose when you go onto the mouthpiece. So the first test that we're going to do, what I'll get you to do is nice normal breathing like you're doing just now, but you'll do it into my machine. And then I'll get you to do a really big breath in, fill up your lungs all the way to the top, and then you're going to blow it out really, really fast for as long as you can, and then a nice big breath in again at the end. So I'm going to show you what I want you to do. So it's like this. All the way in again. Shall we give it a go? Yes. If you want to put your lips and teeth around the mouthpiece now, that's it, and close your lips around. Perfect. We're just going to start off with nice normal breathing, so just in and out nice and normally for me. That's really good, well done. Now take that big breath all the way in and blast out all the way as long as you can. Keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going, and a big breath all the way in again, and off you come and have a rest. Well done. That was good. That's us ready to do the next test now. So I'll get you to come across and have a seat in this box. Have a seat up there for me. This box looks a bit like a TARDIS. What is it for? Well, the box allows us to measure how big your lungs are and how well different parts of your lungs are working. So if you want to turn around and face the other way, and I'm going to put this mouthpiece in for you. Here we go. And we'll just explain how this test works. So we get you to wear your nose pegs for this test as well. But the other thing we have to get you to do is pop your hands up onto your cheeks and that's just because there's a shutter in here and when the shutter closes, we don't want your cheeks to move around too much. Okay, the first thing I'll get you to do is I'll just get you to sit in the box and not do anything for about a minute and that's just because the box gets a wee bit warmer when you go in there and we want to allow it some time to settle. And then once we're ready, you can put the nose pegs on and pop your hands up onto your cheeks. Okay, and we'll start off with just nice normal breathing in and out like you're doing just now and then, once your breathing's nice and steady, I'll tell you that the shutter's going to close and I want you to carry on breathing no just normally, in and out, against the shutter, just for about two breaths. OK, then the shutter will lift and you've got to blow all the way out to empty your lungs and then do a really big breath all the way in and blow all the way out again, again to empty those lungs again at the end. And then we can come off and have a rest. So, sometimes it gets quite warm in the box but we'll try not to have you in for too long. And there's a microphone up there so you can hear me talking to you, but you might need to shout quite loudly to talk back to me. Okay, so you don't need to wear the nose pegs just as now, we'll just shut the door first of all. You okay? Yes. Right, Susan, that's us ready to start. So if you want to put your nose pegs on your nose and put your lips and teeth around that mouthpiece for me and sit up nice and tall and hands up onto your cheeks. That's it. And we're just going to breathe nice and normally in and out to start off with. So just in and out. Well done. So I'm going to close the shutter now. So you breathe in, out, in, out, and then blow all the way out to empty your lungs. Squeeze, 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 all the way out. And a really big breath all the way in and all the way out, long as you can. Squeeze, 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 squeeze. And off you come and have a rest. Right, Susan, let's get you out of this box. 
So do you think that's all that you need to know, Susan? Yes, thank you for showing me the breathing test. That's not a problem. I look forward to seeing the film.